What's going on everyone? Thanks for stopping by. Wanted to share a couple of quick little pickups that I got um, earlier today. Uh, these are Libertads and um, a couple different rounds. So we'll go ahead and start with these. Uh, ended up picking up a couple different Libertads. Um, this one here is a 1982. Then I picked up three of the 1985s. Uh, they had a couple of different ones. Uh, a couple. Of, he actually the place had a tube of these, so I picked up three of them. Uh, of course, I cherry picked the best ones. So eighty fives. I got three of those. And then a nineteen ninety one. And this is the type one, and we'll talk about the type two here shortly. Uh, this is a nineteen ninety three. So you guys see how that one looks right there, the 1993. And then you see the 19... Here, let me give you a comparison. So there's a 93 and a 91. Do you guys see where the one onza is? Which is right there. You guys see the difference? Well, if you have a 1991 that looks like this one, that's called a Type 2, a 1991 Type 2. And um, this one, if it was a Type 2, would be about $150. Of course, you could see the difference on the design change. The Onza is different. The, the mountains are different. The lady is a little bit more defined. The lettering is different. And then the back. Anyways, guys, so yeah, picked up um, six of those. And to talk about those, these, those came in, um, of course, I already took them out of the packages. Uh, this is how I bought them. They were in these packages. And um, so while I'm taking them out of the packages, I'm looking at these. Um, they put a whiteout on, on these, right, on the corners. Um, I actually got a steal on these. I paid a dollar over spot on these. Um, and so they look, it looks like this, right? I don't know if you guys could see how much that is, but I peeled, I peeled some of it off and somebody bought, originally bought these. The 91 says 1150 and then the other one, all these other ones say 1250 on them. So, um, somebody, somebody bought them at a really, really good price a long time ago. Um... Then I also picked up this one right here, which uh, is, let's see, it is a 2016 Republic of Congo, and I guess it's the African Lion. Really nice. This was in a little 2x2. Two two. Of course, I took it out and put it in a larger 2x2 two two flip, and then picked up a round. Now, the round was spot price. The other ones that I just showed you that were eighteen uh, a dollar over spot, which is a hell of a deal. I should have bought more Libertads, but they were the other ones were a little bit more stained, um, and of course I cherry picked the best ones. And this is just a one ounce, uh, seated Liberty design round. It's nothing major. So um, there you have it. Eight more quick ounces at a great price to add to the stack. Um, and, um, yeah, guys, uh, always go out there. If you got local shops or pawn shops, it's always worth it. Go in there, look around, ask if they have silver or anything like that. You'll be surprised. A lot of these places don't put out all their stuff. So you, if you don't ask, you'll never find out. And, um, you know, it, on weekends, I like to hop from place to place to see what they got. You just never know what they're going to have. And you could get great deals by asking. And of course, a lot of these places negotiate. If a guy says, oh, these are 22 it doesn't hurt to say, hey, will you take uh, $20? You know, $2 is not a lot, but it makes a difference. Anyways, thank you for watching. As always, guys, stack on. Please click like, subscribe, leave a comment, and 8 more ounces to add to my 400-ounce goal. Thanks for watching.